Tsubukwe Trust is showcasing the life of anti-apartheid activist Robert Tsubukwe. The Remember Africa exhibition depicts the PAC leader's life and passion for education and knowledge. Tsubukwe was arrested after leading a march to Soweto police station against the past laws in 1960. Tsubukwe is a founding member and first president of the Pan-Africanist Congress. His activism led to his incarceration on Robben Island. Now, Sabukwe has been given a voice in the form of an exhibition. His life depicted on life-size canvases. His love for family also recognized. Even from the comments we heard from the public, public is saying that it is not actually recognized as a struggle icon like other icons. So there is kind of, they say that there is not even a school named after Robert Sobukwe. So there is really a cry in, in the ordinary public to say that we are not recognizing Robert Sobukwe to the best of his abilities that he struggled for freedom as well. For his family, a long overdue tribute. He was a man of uh, many interests which he held dearly. Uh, he was a proud founding member of the pan Africanist Congress and uh, very proud of his association with the pan Africanist Congress. But he wasn't just that. He was also a proud educationist, uh, a teacher. Uh, it's something he held in high regard, uh, the teaching uh, at, um, profession, and uh, he was that. And uh, we want that uh, whatever role we play to uh, convey his legacy to as many people as we can the public intrigued by his life. I was born in 1961, okay, and uh, so those, those, those were the years and that. And I was always really, really interested in these figures, and I knew he was a great man, but not really re recognized. I think it's fantastic that they can showcase this to the world and to the people who live in South Africa. It's important. Sabukwe died on the 27th of February in 1978. Carmel Lochmerg Roberts, SABC News, Cape Town.